So I think we had about 100 people come down today, both from Sarsfield but also from other regions. It certainly wasn't an exclusive Sarsfield thing. We were welcoming all community to come and join in, um, seeing the concert on the big screen, which is raising money for bushfire victims. So over the last six weeks since the fire, we've spent a lot of time, particularly here, building that community connection and that showed through today with everyone knowing each other by first names and having chats together. So I think for those that are fire impacted, the really important steps are cleaning up their properties. So those that have lost houses are incredibly committed to getting that cleaned up as soon as they can. And the same those with sheds. So it's, it is really for those individuals about rebuilding their lives. Um, for us as a whole community, it's about strengthening that community bond and finding ways to make sure that everyone feels supported within the community going forward. So we have Friday night dinners and they will be ongoing while the community see benefit in that happening. We're also holding um, other events at the end of each month so that we can bring in different people that might not be comfortable with Friday night dinners. So we're going to have pop-up cinema and we're also at the end of March going to have a big community day that hopefully will involve a cricket match because that was the thing of the past here is cricket. In all these events, we're really trying to create, I guess the opportunity for people to connect to each other so that when they go back to their homes, they might know their neighbours better. They might be willing to call on them for some help when they wouldn't have before. So it's trying to build that community connection so that everyone's helping each other out and looking out for each other in these times. We're going to need um, that support going forward.